Welcome back to the stuttery star field. I didn't press that. I changed a little bit. I'm gonna see how well that works, but I guess I need a combat situation to actually really test that unless I can. I don't want I don't wanna go through another loading screen. I made or gave the game an FPS limit setup in the Nvidia control panel. And vertical v sync off jump seat what wow. <laughs> turn stuff down graphics wise okay just something where i can sit that's pretty much the biggest change we'll see though we will see if everything works better God. Shields ready. The rest is up to you. Do I actually fly in this game? Or does the robot take care of it? Sadly, ran the resolution down to 75, which was recommended by the article, which means it's not gonna look as pretty. Audio glitches. Oh, that killed my ear. Mm, that killed my ear. Damn. Blech. Where the hell do I even go now? now that we are in orbit, it might be wise to test all controls and systems to oh, ensure that's better. they are not on the verge of catastrophic failure. I can step you through the entire process, or if you're already an experienced pilot, just power up all the systems and we'll be on our way. Hold left, hold and use to switch between systems and I'll locate power. I don't know what to do here, so... Okay. Left shift. Let's boost. Ooh. Left old. Oh, god damn it. Oh, I didn't test ownership. again. Power. Allocating power is under your direct control. Let's go over the engines. Nope. Engines control our maximum speed. Try increasing and decreasing our relative velocity. Use S and a ship's engine has a sweet spot for better handling during turns. Draw your attention to the HUD. You'll notice a speed indicator in the lower left with a gauge that goes up and down as you adjust the throttle. Try yeah, to I'll center see that. the gauge so that it lines up with the center of the vertical bars to its right. Like that. Can be engaged for temporary bursts of speed. I'm not a big fan of flying in space already. Not my kind of games. Let's turn our attention to the shields. Try adjusting power to the shields. Notice more power increases their strength. Shields protect the ship from hull damage. Without a hull, they'll be vaporized. Shield health is displayed in the lower right. Hull damage is below it. Okay. So... You've proven an adequate pilot. Are you familiar uh, with ship combat tactics? Because that's a Crimson Fleet ship bringing its weapons to bear. Start off. Well that I <sighs> We will need to disable their shields. Laser based weaponry is particularly effective. God I already don't know like space combat centered on the HUD. We can walk in to fire a homing missile. It escaped us. Tree to fire on this huh? Where is he? Did I hit it? No. Where? <laughs> oh, Howdy. I'm not a fan. God, 
God damn, I'm just... No mercy! Kicking around randomly, it doesn't lose any health to... She... I'm gonna die here. Ba -ba -bum -bum -bum. Space combat, that's why I'm not playing... I'm not playing any games like that. Three, shoot it. Enemy shields are down, Captain. Ballistic weaponry excels at damaging the hull. Once shields are offline. Just flying into it. Okay, at least it didn't stall it that much. Congratulations on surviving your first starship assault, Captain. I, I don't want we another one. The wreckage for spare parts and other salvage. You will need to fly yeah. close to it before we can access the remains. That's two. Aye, he. I shut it further away from me. Is that close enough? Wait. Did I press the wrong key now? Two more Crimson Fleet ships are jumping into our location, Captain. Oh no. Just leave me alone. I don't know what I'm doing here. Sit down. Oh no. Space combat. Another ship too. Nope. That's why I need to boost. I'm gonna die. Aren't you from that explorer's group? Don't they teach you to fly? Nope, they didn't. You sure so didn't. Oh, damn it. Did I loot something? I don't even know. Okay, press here to repair your ship. Did I repair it even? Damn it. She's just shooting constantly at me. You've already lost! Bird. Apparently I do. Come on, dude. I hate it. Where the hell is? I'm just flying circles. This ain't over. Please let it be over, though. I'm dying. I'm dying. Ah. I hate it. So. wise to test all controls and systems no. to ensure they are not on the verge of catastrophic failure. Well, I fucking need to save in space. You're already an experienced pilot. Just oh, power up damn. all the systems and we'll be on our way. Oh. The hell is the craft drive? He didn't even tell me about that. Oh god damn it. Do I have to turn down the difficulty for space fights so I can enjoy the normal fights? Requires power. Allocating power is under your God. direct control. Let's go over the engines control our maximum speed. Try increasing and decreasing our relative velocity. <laughs> a ship's engine has a sweet spot for better handling during turns. Draw your attention to the HUD. 
you'll notice a speed indicator in the lower left with a gauge that goes up and down as you adjust the throttle. Try to center the gauge so that it lines up with the center of the vertical bars to its right. Boosts can be engaged for temporary bursts of speed. Let's turn our attention to the shields. Try adjusting power to the shields. Notice more power increases their strength. Shields protect the ship from hull damage. Without a hull, they'll be vaporized. Shield health is displayed in the lower right. Hull damage is below it. Start up. Oh god damn and my hole is already messed up. People need to disable their shields. Laser based no. weaponry is particularly effective. If you can keep the enemy ship Jesus centered on Christ. the HUD, Jesus Christ. Get fucking hide it. <sighs> yeah. Very easy. Don't you dare let me fail this again. Spec target E. What the hell? No! What the hell, game? Oh god damn. You're done. Yeah! Because I just stepped out of my goddamn thing. Oh god damn. That better? It's a better to fly like that. Let's end this! The enemy shields are down, Captain. Ballistic weaponry excels at damaging the hull once shields are offline. Oh god damn. Congratulations on surviving your first starship assault, Captain. We should search the wreckage for spare parts and other salvage. You will need to fly close to it before we can access the remains. Am I gonna... And then it tells me to press E. Okay, like that. Good. I'm not a fan of space combat, never was. That's why I never played a game like that before. Two more Crimson Fleet ships are jumping into our location, oh Captain. I'm kicking my goddamn mouse around. Ah. <laughs> I'm pretty sure pressing E just makes me stand up again. Jesus Christ, come on. Come on. Now it's gonna escape us again. See the enemy. Got my number. Jesus Christ. Where is he? Why can't I got them find him? I'm just circling around. Look at that. This one's mine. Come on. Shot! 
the amount of Crimson Fleet hostility has been far more than anticipated. At this rate, the odds of continual assault from their ships are high enough to jeopardize our mission. In short, they are after the frontier and will not stop. We will need to deal with the local Crimson Fleet captain. A recent scan indicates an abandoned facility on the nearby moon of Crete, a perfect staging area for pirates. That's been looted. God damn. Oh, I don't know what you just told me, but I hate flying around in space. This is like the Assassin's Creed ship battles that you either like or hate. No, it's not a big fan of that. Okay. That's probably gonna take forever to get there. Where are you going, ship? Oh god, I can't drink. Otherwise it's just flying off in a random direction. Space is empty. And boring. I'm sure there are even better Starfighter games. I was hoping it was kind of like Mass Effect in that regard. That you don't need to do ship to ship combat. But that's just me complaining. So far it didn't start as bad. That's the main object we got to have to test. Is there, a speed up? Is there a way to speed this up? Can I just... It's not where I need to go, right? That's me. This... Travel to create the hell. I'm confused. So far away. Where am I? Show me V. Show me. Show me. She's. Like I'm riding into the wrong direction. was the whole time here and I don't think I'm making any meters here it's like I'm running against the wall Must be something I'm missing. That's not it, right? I don't have to write to any good um R
Oh Jesus Christ. Yeah, you need to travel like that. Okay. We have arrived in orbit. The abandoned facility with our Crimson Fleet captain is on the surface. Do I actually surface like that now? Or do I have to press data from there? You can open the star map. Star map, I just pressed that already with E. Environments, rotate the planet in the Creed Research Lab. My SMV is like, okay. So I need to press that actually. I don't need to fly around in space. Land. Go. Go. Oh my god. Oh my god. I've heard loading screens take forever and previously when I loaded into the game. Definitely took forever. Forever. I'm already 20 minutes in and I feel like nothing of value happened. I want some combat scenes to test my stuttery, my stutterness. My stutter, stutter, I'm not stubborn. Oh, there's some stutter. I'll follow you from here on out, Captain. You're the least interesting character I could have dreamed of. Hey, that's cool looking though. Exit this. Mm. I heard so many good things about the game, and so far it's just messy and buggy and stuttery. Oh, that looks good though. Can't move quite yet. Audio glitch. Start up. Oh, God. Kind of funny though. Hey. Okay, let's look at my inventory. I have weapons. Good. Oh, I love that thing. Maelstrom, Maelstrom, modified. Rescue, Rip Shark. Oh. It's the pistol. Free. Ops B. Free serious healing, I don't like that, that's too far away. Anyways, I don't think we have bad armor, don't move moving, nope. Nope. I hate that outfit. Armor. That's pretty much just showing me everything I have. Mm. Okay. See what the map says. Can I run? Okay. So I need to go there. What's that? Unknown. That looks like Mass Effect 1 exploring wise. I'm gonna explore a little bit. I like the look of the planet. The abandoned research facility is in this direction. Stella. Big Stella. Endless Stella. Lovely breathing noises too. Ah! <laughs> okay, come down. Oh god, I might have to turn stuff lower. That's how it's going. Start up. Start up. Great stalker. How the hell? To the charge people extra to Be careful, go through Captain. that. Alien creatures are often unpredictable. What do I scan that thing? E scan, okay. Cool. F. God, I wish this game would run good. This looks like minerals. I already forgot F is the scan button. Huh. Okay. Let's 
Sadly, you can't put too many settings off and on and change too much. All the glitches too. <laughs> yep, lovely. Oh. The Crimson Fleet is a confederation of smaller independent pirate crews, all flying under the same banner. They are typically unscrupulous and violent. Is that actually the research station I need to go to? I'll just press the M key for map. It took forever. Forever! Yeah, that's actually where I needed to be. Hmm. Settings I use are not the solution yet. Guess I need to turn more down. We're not there yet. Did I just get <laughs> HQ for C? Seeked. Oh yeah, look. It's kind of weird. Tape. Tape. To measure. Oh, start off. Start off. Oh, the stutter continues. Every sci-fi game needs stutter. God, I can't wait for the Steam reviews. Can't be the only one that's stuttering that bad. Mm, no. Let's take at least two protocols stutter so far. That space was even worse for me. There are just parts where it was a slideshow PowerPoint presentation where the screen for you switched for every 10 to 15 seconds that was dead space especially the last boss fight just started so much and it took them forever to fix it somehow ran and worked flawlessly in that direction and all our indie games but the big triple a games so far this year have been nothing but stuttery messes Try to survive of it better. Bad people, bad jokes. That's value. Oh, why did the chicken cross the road, huh? What's a chicken? Knock knock, who's there? Plan it, plan it who? If I throw a party, will you help me plan it? Right down. Reading that. My Curious, these are United Colonies markings, but we are in Freestar Collective space. It then stands to reason that this was once a secret UC facility. Last days. Sure. I uh, won't read too much here. God damn it, fly. Get rid of my face. Maybe there's a mod immediately that would save my day. It would be a mod that reduces the chunkiness. I need to look how much carry weight I have. The mass 85 out of 120. All your glitches. Just little. Clicking good noises. It's the Callisto protocol over again. Toxin, not that valuable. Rich wooden. Good damn. I saw already videos on YouTube with tips for the game and stuff and uh, showcase I didn't watch it I wanted to go in blind but I'm pretty sure those YouTubers didn't have any problems in that direction oh, those books are worth a lot surprisingly
don't know. Most YouTubers play on the PS5 nowadays. Ooh, a lot of, of value. Because that Xbox and PS5 seem to have less data problems than got them PC at the moment. Even though PC could be the alpha race. Number one. I can't help but loot. Maybe it's just outside and inside the building it's actually working better. That could also be a thing. Dick pick. What the hell is a dick pick? Don't send me one. That's the only thing that comes to mind. Oh no, that's not the inventory. Is that a healing item, the dick pick? No? Resources, dick pics, miscellaneous. That looks like a lightsaber part to me. Ah. Start up. Start up. I would like more FOV too. Okay, let's save here. I'm gonna test right now what else I can turn down. Display, God, it's so bad. Dynamic resolution. I might do it. Doesn't look that much worse. Settings. Display. run around a little bit yeah i believe that might have been the best thing to do god i need to look out for that okay let's save again yes 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 and then we're gonna upload that to youtube ah and then I, uh, in the next video, if everything works smoothly, I'm gonna make a helpful video for once. What? I'm gonna check the Nexus right now too. This part is over. Peace out.